welcome everybody to Just Cause 4. Okay, now before I started the game, apparently I had some save data left on the game. I honestly thought I deleted all of it, but apparently not. But either way, I'm gonna restart from scratch because these games, this particular game with Just Cause 3, it doesn't have a PS um, New Game Plus. You can restart the settlements and stuff like that, but that's about it. So, as for the story mode and stuff like that, nah, not able to. Okay, let's quickly check first. Custom. Yeah, see, this is the thing I've been waiting for. You can customize your guy. Why do I have that suit on? So this is the suit you actually begin with this time. This is Euro of Medici. This is Black Scorpion gear. I, I don't like this because look at his face. It looks weird. I guess we go with this. Unequip Sky Striker. Yeah, okay. So remember how you had the wingsuit, um, Vivranium wingsuit? This one you have the Sky Striker wingsuit. And you can choose the color of the wingsuit you want. Oh, it seems like I literally only have one. That's fine. I keep it gold. Skull, Mitrus, Happy Holidays, Black Hand Skull. Nah, I'm sticking with this. Oh yeah, you have a hoverboard in this thing. I don't remember how to use this thing though. What do you guys think? Blue or red? black hand or ice flow? Now I'm gonna keep with this. That's about that. What's in the black market? Right, you can get weapon packs. I already have that. I already have that. Advanced assault vehicle pack. I already have that. I know I have this. Sea dog and vehicle pack. Sea dogs, vehicle pack. I have that. Yeah, the golden gear pack I have. Brawler mech, I have. Neon racer, I know I have. It's one of the best cars in the game. That's cause for the dragon. I have that. Yes, yes, that other car I was talking about. Look at the flying car. Soaring Speed Vehicle Pack, I have it, and Death Scorpion Pack. See the car on the left side? That's also a pretty good car. I have this as well. Yeah, so I have just about all of these. I, I When I bought the game, I had to choose between normal version, then you get the gold edition, and then you get the complete full set edition. I got the full set edition. Challenges. Um, okay. There. Punch in. Well, the agency's trying to kill us. This, this is a multiplayer version. I know who the agent in charge is. Our old friend Miller. The USS Statesman. Miller's command ship. Go get him, amigo. Actually, I'm still Sheldon. Why you considered the adversary? Smoke from the haters, that's all imaginary. I guarantee I won't have to get in the crown I carry. So bow your heads when you're in the press of a legendary. I'll be damned. Uh, 
Oh yeah, now I remember it. I remember doing this. Yeah, see the expansion pass. I'm pretty sure I have this. No, I don't. Do I? The Daredevil's one I have. The Demon's one I have. And the Danger Rising one I have. So what does the expansion pass have that I don't then? Let's quickly see. Um... Nothing. It has nothing that I do not have. Okay. It grants three-day early access to the expansions, and that's about it. But, alright. Um, that's just for interest. I'm going to press continue. What's... Okay, first off, what's going on here? Alright, first... Holy shit, things look so much different. Uh, okay. Yeah, okay, so here are the customizations for your... Um... <laughs> your grapple and stuff. Okay, so... How do I edit again? Unlock modes. Okay. So... Here's the different, different ones you get. I don't think I even have all of the modes. Okay, I'm missing one apparently. Okay, so you get helium. A helium balloon. Their lifter will pop when destroyed. And then you get gas, explosive hydrogen, meaning it's better made for explos exploding stuff. Alright. And then we get invulnerable, indestructible, fragile. Okay, so indestructible balloons. Meaning the balloons can't be destroyed. Then you get fragile. Meaning they can pop very easily. And then you get invulnerable to player. Meaning I can't destroy them. Would be the ease of that though. And then you get invulnerable to enemies. But I can still destroy them. Yeah, like I just shot me directly with a freaking what rail gun. <clears throat> okay, then you get recommendation. So you get float. It won't go higher than a certain range. Then you get guided. I am not entirely sure how that one works. I guess the way you look is where it goes. Then you get follow. Yeah, this thing is going to be troublesome. And that's that, that. And then you get peak altitude. High, 15 meters. No limit. This will also determine... <coughs> Sorry. This will also determine how high the thing floats. You get no limit. I guess it's struggling to lift them properly. Then you get low, which is 5 meters. Medium 10, high 15. And then you get peak effect as a to hover. Let's quickly see, shall we? 
you can make yourself a little platform in the air. I'm gonna have to relearn all of this stuff, okay? So yeah, it can either hover, it can pop when it gets to its max range. And that's about it. Okay. So that's the balloon. This is retraction and this is the booster. <clears throat> okay, so pulse. The tether will send out a shooting pulse when it reaches its maximum length. Okay. I could just want to check that again. Oh, so you attach one part and then you shoot the other part just into the air, making it do that. Alright. Hey, now. Then you get deactivate. They will stop reacting when it reaches the maximum length. Retracting. Okay. And then you'll get snap. The, the tether will snap when it reaches its minimum length. Wait. Minimum and oh, so when it's minimum, sorry, I've been reading maximum the entire time. <clears throat> Snap will probably be pretty handy for removing the shit and stuff. Alright, so my this one was on pulse. Okay, so then you get length, you get long, sure, uh, that's about it. I think I'll have to get medium. And then you get power yank. Like, does it have to be yanked or does it need to slowly be pulled up? It's going on none. Softly yank it. Let's see how soft is soft, shall we? Ah, it ain't soft! <laughs> and then you get extreme. Holy shit. Oh, yeah, that's pretty extreme to move that thing that much. And then you get extract. Retracting speed. You get fast. Something that heavy is very fast. You get slow, medium, that's about it. And you get different versions of how you want them. And then you get booster. So, the burnout effect. The booster will explode when it burns out. Just like on the little grenades or the mines we could plant in number three. Then it deactivates. It just deactivates. This would be pretty useful because it means you're going to be able to use it multiple times. Yeah, you'll literally be able to fly that. Then you get no limits. Booster will fire and in any direction. All right. Look at you. Then you get lateral up, meaning you can decide how the booster should be, even if you don't place it correctly. Horizontal. No limits. Okay, so I don't have one that just goes up. I should remember that. Then active boosters will burn out after three seconds. Two seconds, five seconds, ten seconds, fifteen seconds, or thirty seconds. Then deploying boosters will instantaneously reach their maximum propelling force. Fast, slow, medium. And then no modifications. Boosters will boost in their standard direction. What else does this mean? Away from camera. Towards other end. No more. Okay. That's about it for that. Then you get the loadout. Yeah, you, you have quite a few people that can drop stuff off you. You can decide which one does what and they just bring it to you. That's on a slot. And at Army of Chaos level 14. 
production speed. <laughs> yeah, I think this is the favorite, um, my favorite plan I have. This is the water air, um, ground one. I think this is then the favorite car I use. My favorite assault, my favorite sniper, yada yada yada. <clears throat> Oh yeah, then you have these quests. Ah uh, yeah, okay, these are the ones that I... I don't think these are... Okay, no, these are just the normal challenges. It's not the mission quest you have to do. Yeah, so you can see there is... A lot. Small arms, basically SMGs. Okay, now these aren't SMGs. <laughs> Heavy weapons. Lightning gun. There's a lightning gun, boys. A wind gun. Custer bomb launcher. There's a rail freaking gun. But I don't think neither the railgun or the lightning gun has infinite ammo, which seriously is gonna suck. Yeah, of course, then you can ask for vehicles. As you can see, I actually have to get a ton of vehicles. I never bother to get the vehicles in this thing. <laughs> Rubber ducky. Then you get combat vehicles. Huh. Longbow cannon truck. <laughs> Bloody hell. War Jeep assault truck. Falconer AA tank. Then you get stunt vehicle. That's a stunt vehicle. Bullshit. This and this, believable. That, no ways in hell. Monster trucks, yeah, the boat that can go on ground and water, snowmobile, I don't know what for. Then you get the sport vehicles, rigged serpent, okay, rigged Calvado, rigged Copas. <coughs> Boats. And then you get industrial vehicles. Right. So, yeah, okay. Amelia Turk is. Oh, yeah! That's something I'm loving about this now. And all the more is this. We're gonna get through that lightning storm. We need a way to keep Trap, it. Parachute, double tap, reel in. Um, break, hold. Oh. Wingsuit. Let's check something, shall we? Ah, uh, it doesn't have that feature. As you can see on the bottom right is the suit's boost. And um, it doesn't make the screen shake, which means you can't just do this. Infinitely. <laughs> yeah, that's what the missiles look like. Air brake, hoverboard, and fire jets. Yeah, you can't sharp turn. I mean, you can, but it, it breaks you. That's shit, actually. And you can't break and boost at the same time either. You can shoot them surprisingly quick though. And as you can see, the boost lasts forever! Okay, so this isn't the best save data I have of the game. Because the best save data I actually have of the game is completed, like I finished the game. So it's only some of the data. 
yeah, okay, no, no, this is definitely not the best save that I have, because according to this, I haven't done anything, basically. Yeah. Just about nothing. Freaking hell, the map is a lot more weird in this thing. Um... <clears throat> How can I get my map legend away? I don't want that thing constantly there. But yeah, it pretty much looks like I haven't done fuck all in this game. <laughs> Alright, but anyways. Return to main menu. Loading. We're gonna start a completely new game, which means I ain't gonna have all those modifications. I'm only gonna have the cars I bought and the weapons that I bought, and uh, except for the weapons they give you in the beginning of the game. Pretty much, I'm gonna have next to nothing, but that's fine with me. New game. Start a new game will reset all progress. Are you sure you want to start a new game? Yes, I am. Alright, I'm not gonna lie, when I played this thing for the first time, honestly it blew my mind of how good it was. <clears throat> Number three, don't get me wrong, was pretty good and all, but it had nothing on this. The amount of challenges and stuff you can do in this one was far more than the ones in number three. The black eyes at it again. Black Former and agency operative yeah. Rico Rodriguez. Up to this point, his whereabouts have been unknown since our withdrawal from Medici. Responsible for deposing half a dozen heads of state. The Black Hand have encountered him before in San Espirito, where he assassinated our employer, President Salvador Mendoza. So I've been busy. Again in Medici, where he overthrew Sebastiano Di Ravello. How can that must mean he's from number two? This is his handler, Tom Sheldon. We've learned Rodriguez's motivation for liberating Medici was personal. <clears throat> you have briefed me on this man before, Commander Morales. We're preparing. Yeah, a she's gonna be a to bitch to be handled with. Of course, Nurse Minosa. Intelligence suggests that he is the son of Miguel Rodriguez. My Miguel Rodriguez? Hmm. Huh. And. And he's here, in Solis. Now. Yeah. That's the next place, Solis. I wonder what happened in Just Cause 1 then. Because just as they said, Just Cause 2 I killed the president, 3 I killed the president, <laughs> the general president. This is now 4, and I know I'm going to kill that woman eventually. I can't quite remember the guy. So, that's my father's super weapon. Project Diapa. Mira. He was a kind man. This is the woman that, that helped with the resistance in number three. Doesn't make sense he would build such a thing. My uncle was a good man too. And they both ended up dead. Right. Lots I of think. Questions, hmm? Time to get some answers. You can't do this alone. I have people who can help us. Mira, I've done this kind of thing before. This is different. I can handle some bad weather. It's more than bad weather, Rico. If you would just listen to me. Mira, a plan is a list of things that go wrong. I like to keep my list short. Just be ready. When I patch you into that console, you'll have to find Espinosa quickly. He answers my questions. We destroy Project Diapa. Plan. Hmm? Where? Buena suerte. Oscar Espinosa, better be ready to talk. Comes check. Hear you loud and clear. I'm going to monitor your progress from a safe distance. <laughs> I can't grapple. I mean, wheels in. 
I can't aim! I just realized! <laughs> I know R1 is going to be nade and R2 is going to be shooting. Okay, um, options, controls, let's figure out what's what. Precision aim, yes, finally! Tap, hold, tether, air select, switch objective. Assault rifle switch. Grappling hook action. Equip grappling hook loadout. Release tethers. Oh, I, I already released them then. Move. AR select. Tap air scan. Alright. <clears throat> Comlink menus. Fire primary. Air track. Untrack. Fire secondary. What? Old lock on air switch. Wingsuit, melee, cancel, reel, and hoverboard, break, tap, reload, switch weapons, jump. Wait, what's grenades then? Oh, I don't have nades. I just shot the nade from the gun. Okay, well, let's try that again. They're out of pulling themselves in. Right, let, let me test that and make sure that it is actually doing that. Yeah, it's pulling it in on its own. And it's doing it pretty shitly as well. Under barrel grenade launcher. I'm seeing explosion. What's going on? Gotta put these gun through its bases. Don't want to go in unprepared, do I? Of course not. Wait, I have to destroy this as well. <laughs> okay, well, I ain't shooting that because I don't have ammo anymore. <laughs> Are you actually shitting me? Woman. Oh boy. That's a big tower. Espinosa promises it will change the world. No more tornadoes or hurricanes. And most of Solis believes him. Project the Yapa won't be a problem after today, Mira. If your plan works. It will work. Well, you can Maybe. turn much easier on this thing with the uh, parachute. You're gonna come face to face with a black hand. We've come face to face before. Heading up. There you go. Ow. I just killed myself from that. <laughs> okay, so I'm a bit more brittle in this game. <laughs> oh no. And ammo is very Maybe. scarce in this game. <clears throat> Follow that piping. You're gonna come face to face with a black hand. 
We've come face to face before. Heading up. Oh yeah, you can reel in a lot easier. Let's see, can he survive this? Ow. Senor, this is a restricted area. I don't give a crap, bitch. Who said that? Get clapped! Oh, I still can run. Weren't too happy to have me poking around. The Black Hand are highly trained, Mark. Oh, I can still fast reel in. Espinosa. His own <coughs> private army. Pretty good one, too. <laughs> Not good enough. You're mine now. And this time I'm pulling you towards that. Yeah, cyanide. There you go. No sweat. Hold it. I need to break this. Ow. That hurt. I forgot. Also, notice how different his voice is. Yeah, go blow up over there. Find that console. You don't want to be out there when that case starts. Almost there. Oh, I think I'm supposed to be inside of this. There we go. people here? I don't see it. Oh, yeah, there is. Hola. <laughs> oh, what do we have here? Great full of weapons. Well, they black hand never deploy unprepared. Wait, I can't take this as well, can I? Ah, no, it throws that away. What is this then? Ow! Grenade launch, right? Alright, I'll have fun while I'm at it. Sign 
Nara. How do I switch weapons again? Not that one. Oh. There we go. Gotta be shitting me, right? Who wants some? Come get some! Oh shit, he wants some. Okay then. Got a black hand here. I need ammo. Take your time. Actually, don't take your time. Hurry the hell up. survive this long? This is not an ordinary man, Senor Spinoza. See, si. we might as well make sure. See, si, Senor Espinosa. Let's see what Project Diapa can do, shall we? Senor. We'll take a few moments for the court to reach full power. Do you think you can keep him occupied until then? This is Commander Morales. We have a threat on sight. Activate Iapa's defenses. Engage all artillery towers. That woman, with Rico at the airport. Is that who I think it was? See. Si. Deal with that, please. With pleasure. through the video as well. Rico. Rico, this is Mira. Please respond. Mira. Come in, Rico. Please respond. Mira. Rico. Ay, Dios mio, you're alive. I lost your GPS. See, si, my grappling hook's broken. 
So is my wingsuit. Parachute. Maybe a few ribs. I'll need to make repairs. I have tools at El Abismo. What's your location? A forest? I don't know. <laughs> I'm sending you my coordinates. Hope it works. Got it. I'll see you soon. Shit. I got a good question for you guys. If you had to decide on which arm the grappling hook should be, which side would you want it? <clears throat> Personally, I would want it on the right, but I'm going to shoot the gun with my right arm. So I'm going to take it on the left because I'm right handed. <laughs> Not having my grappling hook is like missing a limb. Ah, uh, doesn't look safe. Never seen anything like Yapa before. Uh, Mira might be right. I Mira, wish there was I'm a freaking running thing. button. People here must not be afraid of heights. I know you're not. I'm not, but I usually have a parachute. Hmm. Chopper. That's not good. Empty it out fast. Half the people leaving here are trying to get away from Espinosa and his black hand. Second time I've seen that symbol. Awful. Agua. The Black Hand are casing the village. Does that happen often? Almost never. Maybe somebody attacked their weather base. Yeah. Tools? Gracias. She's best. I don't think I could take Project Diapa alone. I agree. I'm saying I was wrong. You were right. Is that a distress signal? I didn't think you were with the agency anymore. Help me with this. What do we do about Iapa? Between the blizzard and those artillery towers, I can't get close. I have a couple of ideas. Tell me. Wait. Listen. Your actions in the next few minutes may determine the fate of this community. I am Commander Morales. I have tolerated El Abismo for years. To maintain order hey, and justice. Hey, it's Miles' mother. <laughs> this place to serve as a refuge for the criminal and the disenfranchised. But last night. A terrorist attack was launched against the Project Iapa facility. The culprit was abetted by a conspirator from this village. Who is that? Gabriela. She killed my uncle when I was a girl. <clears throat> she knows we're working together. If Mira Morales is not surrendered to me immediately, I'll be forced to conduct an exhaustive investigation. Every home will be searched. Every citizen's identity will be checked. And all transgressions will be harshly prosecuted. <laughs> you! 
remember this guy. Where is Mira? Where? I have to stop this. Gabriela! Let him go, cousin. Cousin? At least you aren't a coward. Your father would be disgusted with the monster you've become. You two traitors can discuss your disappointment together, in prison. Load to my chopper! Mira! You gone fucked up. When I tried, then I got hurt! Suck on a gent. I think we just started a rebellion. We didn't have to drag these people into this. They are what we need to put down Project Diapa. Well, they'll need more guns. Eso. There's a factory down the road from here. Abandoned. Casquillos vacíos. He used to manufacture black hand weapons years ago. Let's check it out. Luis, right? Organize these people. Anyone who wants to fight the black hand gets to fight. Is you up for it, Sargento? Si, senor. Mira. I need to make sure my gear is working. I'll meet you at the factory. All right. Hope everything works. Ha! Perfect. It's Luis, uh, I mean, Sargento here. Mira a mí, un mincho a casquillos vacíos. Excuse me. That's not what I decided. <clears throat> I want a golden, right? Golden, why? Sargento and Izzy did some research. They can help you get this place up and running. Who's Izzy? Hola. Okay. I'm, a I'm not gonna lie. That's what you've got. Turning. Your AR lens, Mira told me. Already done. You have an AR lens? Like a little computer on your eyeball? Something like that. Let's get started. Okay, Sargento. You're up. Listo. Here's your mission. The factory needs to be powered on, but the doors to the electrical room are being held shut by backup generators. <laughs> Mission accepted, Sargento. Your AR lens will show you where to look. It's only a matter of time before Gabriela sends more black hand to stop us. We need to get these people gone fast. Watch out! Direct hit. <laughs> I don't suppose this can mark enemies for me, can it? 
You find the entrance to the generator building. That was odd. Fuel barrels. Hmm. Generator's well shielded. Can you turn it off? I think I can use my grappling hook to rip the plating off. Holy shit. <clears throat> One generator down. Let's see what you have, shall we? Just more ammo. Two down, one to go. I'm patched into the black ant gums, and they're on their way. Pick up the base hardware. You little twat. I have so very little ammo of that in English, so maybe I shouldn't use that. An AA gun, this will help. There we go. Get off. Here's the last one. I see how it is. Yeah, so you throw a weapon that you currently have on. Oh, I like that. And the doors just opened. Choppers and troops hated this way, Rico. Better wake this place up or we'll be fighting them off with sticks and stones. Sticks and stones will break your bones. Here then? How the hell do I get in? How do I get in? Oh. Heading in. Find the breakers and flip them. Come on, man. Hmm. Need to use my grappling hook. And the black hand are almost here. Just hit the master override. Oh, okay. 
Just checking something. Yeah. Hera, we're in business. Let's call everyone in. Just give the order. The front line is represented by the lines on your map. This is where the army of chaos is holding back the black hand. Okay. This icon represents a deployed squad. Secure regions by advancing or deploying squads. Select the Machinki region. Secure the region by giving the order to advance. Your squads will move forward and the front line will follow. Tap. Dale, let's kick some ass. Rico, you should get back outside. All right. It sucks that I only have two weapons though. Hmm. You got us those guns just in time. They black hand are deploying their forces across the river. We won't be able to advance the line without more fighters. Any ideas? We became soldiers after what you did in the slums. Create more chaos. More recruits will come. A whole army of chaos. This is what you wanted from the start. Oscar Espinosa owns this island. The people can't fight him without losing their jobs, their homes. And even if they tried, what chance would they have against a black hand? We have a mutual goal, Rico. You help these people defeat the black hand, and we'll help you get to Oscar Espinosa. Okay, Mira. We'll do it your way. What's first? I got some ideas, Rico. Mario. Your eyeball with more information. Radio my eyeball. The whole army of chaos. Sure. Army of chaos. Radio my eyeball. Come on, dude. Mission <sighs> without accomplished. Oh. Chaos Bar. To advance your front line, you need new squads for your army. To inspire people to join you, destroy black hand infrastructure and vehicles. This create chaos. You'll notif you'll be notified when you have enough chaos to recruit people to into new squads. Okay. <laughs> Rico, it's me, Luis, and Sargento. Listen, I've got some of my people together, and we've got a surprise for you. Here, I'll send you the coordinates. This thing has a hell of a mag, you know? Well, that's it for this video. Thank you very much for watching, guys. Please leave a like, subscribe, hit that bell, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.